I'm going to use what I call the kinder, gentler takeaway or the premium, premium equipment close. And you're not going to close the first time I try to close you. And then I'm going to use the reduce to the ridiculous close. Okay? Um, what's the reduce to the ridiculous close? Okay, if you don't, if you don't, yeah, don't, if you don't know, just tell me you don't know. Okay, um, it's, it's a close that's been around since uh, Jesus Christ, literally, all right? I mean, the, uh, the Philistines were using this thing back, you know, <laughs> a thousand B.C. <laughs> Say again. You said, you didn't go to the cross or you? <laughs> <laughs> all right, um, but it's still highly effective. Everything I teach is designed to make it easier for the customer to say yes. Now, we're going to make some assumptions here. Um, we're going to make the assumption that the customer can pay the $2388, okay? Mm -hmm. If the customer can't make that payment, where's our mistake? You put them on the wrong car. You put them on the wrong vehicle, okay? But in this particular case, the customer just doesn't want to because, well, what percent? Like, Nathan, how many cars are you selling a month? Twelve. Okay. Of those, of the twelve cars a month you sell, in fact, I'll ask all of you this. Uh, Jeffrey, uh, what percentage of the people you uh, deliver are leaving with the highest payment they've ever had in their entire life? I'll say 80. Yeah, mo most. Yeah, most. Okay? So there is, there's a psychological barrier that people have got to break through, and it's our job to help them break through that. So... So Nathan, your payment at that term will be $2,388. I need you to put a check mark by that and an okay it down at the bottom so I can get your new truck ready for delivery. Steve, I just can't make that payment though. That's the only thing. Uh, Nathan, I hear you. I hear you, my man. I'm, I'm hearing that every single day from almost all of my customers. Now, when you say you can't make that payment, you can make it. You just don't want to make it, correct? A little bit. Okay. Hey, look, I don't, I don't blame you a bit. Prices are higher than they've ever been. Interest rates are at 15-year highs, although they're still fairly reasonable. Um, so I understand your reluctance. However, um, would a payment of maybe 200 bucks a month sound better? 200 bucks a month less sound better to you? Could you do 250? Mm, well, I'm not even going to do 200. I just want to know if it sounds better to you. Yeah, it sounds better. Okay. Look, we actually could deliver you a truck. Um, at a payment that's a couple hundred bucks less. That wouldn't be a problem. But Nathan, I don't think you'd want us to do that. And here's why. You told me the bigger engine was a must-have. Mm -hmm. Is it? Yeah. Okay. You told me that that truck with the tech package will be the nicest truck you've ever driven in your entire life. Is the tech package important to you? A little bit. Okay. You told me the way that that vehicle looked, the cosmetics that the high, country ve the high country trim level comes with made it stand out like no other truck you'd ever seen before. Are the cosmetics important to you? For sure. Okay. Look, you're only paying 200 bucks a month for all of that, okay? Are there any other accessories you'd like to add to this truck before you take delivery? Bedliner. So you weren't supposed to cook. Oh, you, right. you, you just no, hooked. No. Okay. No. Okay. <laughs> so, so you said no, 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 there, no other accessories. That's it. It's perfect. So the, it's perfect. That's what I wanted to hear. Okay, it right down there at the bottom. No, you're not supposed to close yet. I didn't close on the first, and I thought I was close on the second one. No, no you're not supposed to, to close yet. I don't want to. Do okay. That. All right, but now let me ask you a question. What's easier to get a customer to say yes to? Twenty-three eighty-eight or two hundred? Two hundred. 200 and isn't that really the difference yeah, yeah. he didn't want to do 2388 I don't blame him he could he just doesn't want to so now we're going to isolate what makes the difference between 2188 and 20 and 2388 and he acknowledged he wanted a bigger engine he liked the tech package and the looks of the vehicle okay so I close him again but he doesn't close mm 